up guys, Brit Tech here back with another video and today we're going to be discussing how to access your screen time on iPhone 12. So let's get into it. Go ahead and open up your settings and scroll down to screen time and select it. And so here is where you would access your screen time. As you can see, my daily average is five hours and 44 minutes uh, to spend time on my phone. And if you just select see all activity right below, you'll be able to get a full view of how you spend your time on your phone. They give you a weekly standpoint and also a daily standpoint. And if you just scroll through, you can see how many times you pick up your phone and uh, it shows you the different apps that you spend most of your time on. And it's just a broad overview of how you use your phone. But now let's go back to screen time. And as you can see, there are several options that you can select below for one being downtime where you can schedule time away from the screen another one would be app limits where you can set time limits for different apps or communication limits where you can set limits based on your contacts and then another good one would also be always allowed so when you choose this it's allowing you to choose apps you want at all times guys and then lastly would be the content and privacy restrictions where you can block inappropriate content and if we just continue to scroll down you'll see that you can also set a screen time passcode and this will allow you to secure your screen time settings you can also share across devices and set up screen time for family now if we just go ahead and scroll back up I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, select some of these different options like downtime. You can just enable it right there. App limits, you can add limits and, you know, so on and so forth. Now, the good thing about um, always allowed apps, you can go ahead and add and take away different apps that you want to allow all the time. It says always allowed apps are available during downtime or if you selected the all apps and categories app limit. So of course, if you wanna add an app, you just select the green circle and then you can take it away as well by selecting the red circle and then deleting it. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.